Another three for the Sparks. Building one of the league's most diverse skill sets, a can get buckets from anywhere. And for the dream, Ryan Howard hit the ground running in her rookie season. And her first week is a double idea. Ryan Howard is the legendary conference player of the league. It's been 20 years since a rookie won the honor in their opening week. From the jump, Ryan looking like a franchise level player. Now here's Robinson. Robinson. Robinson gets the ball to a wide open shooter. Selfless play pays off with an assist. Pass to Agumake from deep three point range. Rebounded by Parker. Here's Billings. She's covered by Agumake. The Sparks with the lead. Now Samuelson. Thomas. Robinson covering. Sinks the triple. Just They've Thomas. built a big lead very early. Boy, right from the tip, there isn't anything they haven't done well. It has been a textbook dominant performance. Here's Billings. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game for her. Here's Ogumake. That one. Good for two. They made one yes. bucket after Just another Thomas. since the game this game started. I wonder if this is the early stages of a blowout. Well, let's not get ahead of ourselves just yet. Yeah, not going to go that far, but it has been pretty ugly so far. Pass to Thomas. Stevens up top. Fires the three. Another three for the Sparks. And that's what built them the early lead. Killer shooting from beyond the arc. And the defense needs to recognize that and get out there on those shooters. Pronto. Here's Parker. Here's Coffey. Tough sequence there. They just couldn't get it to fall. Here's Samuelson. Here's Ogunike. Sinks that one from the post. More points for Neca. And the best part about her offensive game, she makes four shots to get to the score. And a double-digit lead on the Sparks ahead, up by 15. And back in a moment as we'll get underway with quarter two. Okay, fans, put your hands in the And it's been all one-way traffic through the first as the second quarter gets underway. And quite a position here for the Sparks to be in. What do you guys think? It's been a long-range battle for them, and one they are winning. Some sharp shooting from deep, a uh, big part of why they're up. And it's the Sparks ball. They lead by the biggest margin of the game, 15 points. Controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. I admire how Stevens relentlessly crashes the board. It's, it's pretty special for a young player. Now Robinson. No scoring yet from her, but that's likely to date. Sparks foul. First personal foul, team's first. First team foul. Here's Robinson. From the inbound. Well, quite simply, defense is all about effort. And it doesn't hurt also when you have strength and length like a Gumake in addition to that effort. Here's Hammy. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. Textbook. Nice pass. Nice catch. Nice shot. And they've been struggling here offensively. Bit of a dry spell for sure. Pulls up. Her shot is good. Making her a perfect two for two from the floor. The long arms of Hamby coming in handy with the steal. Also the wherewithal to start the break. Get the ball Jasmine up court. Thomas. And as they continue to dominate, you wonder just how much higher this lead might get. And it really could get out of hand because their defense has been just as excellent as their offense. Great overall game. And the dream call time here. We've seen Ogumake really having a great game. Okay, she continues to throw them with a score and the coaching staff is going to have to come up with a different defensive approach. Just over a minute has passed here in the second quarter. 
Kept alive. Here's Billings. And again, unable to change momentum here. Pass to Agumake from deep. And it's Atlanta with the rebound. It's the Akafi on the wing. And here's Billings. Hamby grabs the miss. Okumake outside. Cook. Offline with the three. Before the 2021 season, the dream had an ownership change. A welcome, fresh start for Atlanta. Azare Stevens with the block. With a good motor and high level of activity, Stevens has become a force on defense. And you're the dream. Still looking for their first basket since the first quarter. And here's Billings. Count it. Good. Good. And interestingly enough, an ex-player is part of the new ownership group in Atlanta. Yeah, that's something I'd like to see more of going forward. Former players getting a chance to own teams. I think it would help the communication between the current roster and management. You love her, her presence on this team as a scorer. It has a calming effect for them. She's a fallback option whenever they need one. Here's Billings. Pass to Parker. And the lane is off the glass. Parker. So poised on the offensive guys. end of the floor. Parker is a dependable scorer. Back to Thomas. Cook. That shot's Cook. good on the assist by Jasmine Thomas. What a passing display she's putting on. She is spoiling us today. Just another incredible assist for the highlight reel. And the reel is getting quite long. Scooped up. Coffee. Goes up again. No good that time. Some solid defense from Jasmine Thomas. Shoots the three. Another three for the Sparks. Love the selfless, intelligent play by Andy. Puts the ball into the wide open shooter's hands. Atlanta calls timeout. Yeah, the coaches seeing a lot of their shots miss the mark. He figured it'd be a good time to draw something up. Yeah, all my coaches always had one go to play that you just keep back pocket and that's probably the one that the coach is drawing up here trying to get their team an easy bucket out of this break it's snapped up Parker that one is good again with that basket a relentless attitude Parker commits herself to the boards whenever she's on the court and here's Neca from the arc the shot misses and it's Atlanta the other way to the inside. Here's Gray. Azaray Stevens with the block. They get it back. Okumake outside. Shot's good by Samuel. Recognizing the defense's miscues and capitalizing on them. That's part of what makes Agumake so special. Right there, she's able to find someone wide open. Yes, it's good. She always knows where her teammates are going to be, and she'll have that ball there waiting for them. Here's Samuelson. That shot's good on the assist by Jasmine Thomas. This is what Thomas does best. Her incredible floor awareness allows her to consistently find the open teammate. On the wing, Alicia Gray. Tried to come right back with the three of her own, but it's no good. And the Sparks with possession here. This one for three, and the Sparks oh, another Stevens. three. A prototypical stretch four. Stevens' range extends way beyond the three-point line. Here's Howard, and yep, it's good. Oh, well, look, that's just simply a great move. She dusted off the defense and got to the cup with an easy basket. Trying to beat the bus. Second quarter. Eight dominating first half of play. And so far, it Four hasn't two. been close. The Los Angeles Sparks. Sparks on top. Just Four. dominating this one. And join us right back here after the break for the start of the second half.
first half wasn't even close. And we'll see if there is a comeback on our hands or more of the same as we get the third started. Really an incredible game from Neko Gumake. Her play in the first half was very disciplined, very efficient. Her shot selection was consistently excellent. That's right, and uh, whether it's been from mid-range or in tight, she's taking only what the defense is giving her and not trying to do too much. Welcome back to the start of the second half. Big margin on our hands, but we'll see if that gap narrows down in the final two quarters. Uh, so many talented players in the league. Anyone you think that gets overlooked? Oh, maybe Ray not Stevens. overlooked, but Neka Agumake sticks out to me. Didn't get named in the United States team that went to Tokyo, despite clearly being one of the best in the world. And for me, it's Alicia Gray, because you simply can't quantify what she brings with her defensive intensity. And when you look at many players like Gray, they deserve more props. And his partner is an intelligent player, someone that plays to her strengths very well. And that's good as she hits both shots. Here's Samuelson, guarded by Howard. For three, Jordan Canada. Diane Parker grabs the miss. Goes outside. Howard gets the bucket. Yeah, yeah I'd say that shot was well within her range. I hope so. There's nothing like a one-footer. Well, there are so many things that players like to do to unwind. But what if I told you that Ryan yeah, Howard okay. loves to draw? And that painting cartoon characters is her favorite. Jones outside. And the layup falls. That's what the fix there for. Get your defender off her feet and drive right around her. And one of the brightest young stars in the league, Ryan Howard. Howard, just so many off the floor talent. In addition to, to painting, Howard loves to crochet. Yeah, I mean, she plays the piano, creates graphics. And Ryan Howard, just a, a brilliant player and a brilliant person. And they pick up two. Does all the little things that pay off in big ways. Parker is so easy to root for. Pass to Agumake. And a great assist by Jordan Canada, and that one falls in. Just on fire from beyond the arc. Seems like just about all her points are coming from deep. And the Sparks another three. And they are just killing them with the three-point shot here in the second half. Yeah, and the defense knows it. They are fully stretched out there trying to stop the three and still haven't been able to do it. Yeah, I don't know defensively well. what they can do. Okay. Third personal foul. And she will take her third and fourth free throw shot of the night. Atlanta, Cheyenne Parker at the line for two. And the first one drops. So both teams making some changes here. And good on both. Canada. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. And another three from Agumake. You have to respect the outside game from Agumake. She's not just a post player. Pass to Billings. Parker inside. And another shot. And Shane Agumake with the block. Here's Samuelson. Nine points in the game. North Canada for three. And it's Billings with the rebound. Third quarter here, and three minutes have come off the clock. Banked in off the glass. That's a good look. That is a good look. And she'll make that one most of the time. For three, Neko Rumake. And Jones pulls it down. Here's Billings. She's covered by Agumake. And a basket by Howard. With good size for the guard position, Ryan Howard is able to use that size to stretch the floor. For three, Neko Agumake. Good. And Jordan Canada gets the assist. She's made the most of her chances, hasn't she? She needs to keep on working to get these good looks. Here's Billings. Guns 
up empty down low. Those chances, usually they're two points for her. The D, I guess, is just a, enough to bother her. So effective from beyond the arc. Ogumake relishes any chance she gets to pull the trigger. Now here's Jones. Cannot say enough about her individual performance so far, even if the all-around team effort has been lacking. Samuelson. Another three for the Sparks. Effective moving the ball from the front court. Hampy's a willing passer. Both loose. Here's Billings. She's covered by Ogumake. Shot by Billings, no good. That he should be thanking her for that miss. Ogumake outside for three. Jordan Canada, and it's Atlanta with the rebound. Well, she's definitely a threat for deep, but it just hasn't been going for her tonight. She might want to avoid that shot for a while. That's some good awareness from Howard right there. He is excellent at getting the ball to her open teammates. Pass to Samuelson. No gut on the three. That will count. And no good. At the end of the, the, end quarter, of the third the quarter, a huge lead. And this one may already have been decided. The Sparks on top, delivering the blowout. And right after this, we'll bring you the start of the final quarter here on 2K Sports. Welcome back, fourth quarter of action starting up in what has been a one-side show. And here are the dream. Gray with it. Now Brown defending. It's deflected. Yeah, she's able to get it back. Ogumake outside. And the three ball is good. What a feed by Brown, an off guard maybe by position and by trade. Her uh, passing abilities get better each year in the league. Knocks it loose. It's off her leg. Defensive violation. The official is saying it was kicked. Substitution on the court. And so here's Atlanta. Here's Robinson. Using the post move to get the new points. Well under six feet. Danielle Robinson she doesn't care about her height. She can score from everywhere, including down low. That was a second look at our mobile one drive. Amazing control on display. Really made that drive look easy, but that had a high degree of difficulty. And here we go, the dream on the fast break. Here's Gray. That shot missing. Now the Sparks take it the other way. Here's Brown. Bangs home the trifecta. Such a consistent, reliable option from deep. Lexi Brown, top 10 in the WNBA in three-point shooting during the 2019 campaign. Here's Mike Sell. Back to Robinson. Pass to Hillman. Over Stevens. And it's Hillman missing. In the WNBA, free agency has become much more important over the last few years. That play can be taken. Candace Parker see from uh, L.A. to Chicago. She signed points. to the sky in 2021. And Candace was key in Chicago winning their first ever WNBA championship. We are seeing, over the last uh, couple of years, as you said, more impact signings. And that's great for the league. Because the offseason has just become so interesting. And I like to see star players getting to choose where they go. It makes the league really exciting. To the paint. Drops in for set for two. Superb assist. She was crafty, creative, and the ultimate teammate on that play. Outside Stevens. Another three. Awesome the Sparks. Since the start of the fourth, Brian, that three-point shot has really been there for them. Yeah, doing an excellent job, Tim, of finding the open teammate on the perimeter this quarter. The three-pointer is a major weapon for them right now. Here's Morrell. She tries for three. 
Mike Sell pulls it in. Alicia Gray, she's open. Rebound by the Sparks. She has slipped into a real funk here. Definitely. The basket is not looking very big to her at this point. It's good on the putback. There you go. Relentless pursuit of the ball. I love it. She never stops working. And so here is Atlanta. They really want to find that igniter here. That's right. Their offense is ground to a standstill. Maybe you need to suit up, Tim. They need a spark. Okay with the rebound. Two minutes remaining Just in the game. stay Two closer. Uh, I mean, really, that's all the defender had to do there. Stevens. Yes, and it's Shane oh, Okay, Stevens. picking up the assist. With the fundamentally sound skill set, Stevens is able to create offensively. To end the run. Good work defensively by Shane Ogumake. And it's the Sparks ball. Here in the fourth, they've only allowed just four points. Buries it from three-point range. Well, Destiny Henderson is so skilled at seeing the whole floor. And Atlanta has possession. Wide open look. Stevens grabs the board. This has not been a quarter to remember for her. I mean, what's going on right now? What is this? She's not making any sort of impact for them at that end of the court. Solid work right there. There's a big difference in field goal percentages of these teams in the second half. And that difference has come about because we've got one team moving sharply, getting good shots, and the other just a little bit stagnant. It's tough to watch. Yeah, one coach did his job at halftime. The other, not so much. Now here's Brown. Pass to Henderson. Another three for the Sparks. Well, it, is, it wasn't already out of reach. It is now thanks to the spurt that they're having. And why put on the brakes now, Tim? I say just keep on firing. Man, Brian, you want to run up the score? Here's Mike Sell. Oh. Yep, that one to go. Just like the coaches drew it up. Easy hoop. Gray with the perfect feet. Brown with it. Another three Let's for the Brown. Sparks. Three. What a performance. It seems like every three she shoots is going to go in. I mean, she is in the zone. Now here's Gray. And a fishing, accurate three throw shooter. Gray is not the person you want to set the line. And she makes the first. Shooting for the Both good at the line. And the Sparks with possession here. Henderson guarded by Jones. For three, De'Erica Hamby. And the Sparks, another three. Awesome to see zero hesitation from Hamby there. Gets the pass, gets the shot off, points at the board. Count that one. Yes. Outstanding entry pass. He knew exactly where to go with that ball. Here's Henderson. Good on the three-point shot. Henderson. And we know Henderson can drain it from deep. And if we remember it, well, the defense, they must remember it. And so it's the Sparks taking care of business. In That's the one. end of the game. Resounding victory for them. And enemy Let's territory. It was enemy territory. Make sure but to get home the safely. Way that they we'll see you the next sporting event. They took the crowd completely out of it. That's how to get it done on the road. And that's a wrap, everyone.